Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, and anybody else throughout the world, I am the Grumpy Vlogger. Welcome to my channel, and let's see what's going to be on today's episode. How do, folks? I take it everyone is surviving. This is being recorded the actual day after Thanksgiving. Had to get out, had to go up here. Got to run up and get some get some milk i'm out of milk a little rainy out today a little cooler uh yeah almost all of that's my real hair some of it might be rangers but most of that's mine uh looks like it's needing some trimming up and uh i'll get tired of it and shave it off and i'll be back clean shaving again but yeah, no, something different. Judy don't like it. And, uh, my daughter-in-law asked me if I was becoming a Mormon, and I said, no way. I said, hey, having one wife was enough. I don't need more than one. I know Mormons don't have more than one wife. Well, at least they're not supposed to. There's a few of them that have broke away that kind of went out there on a limb, but, you know, uh, but no, I, I'm not Amish, I'm not Mormon, I'm not Mennonite, I'm just growing the whiskers and I don't feel like having facial hair up there, I just, so I got a little bit of something to keep my chin warm, and, uh, uh, but anyways, I hope everybody had a, had a, uh, enjoyable Christmas and an enjoyable Boxing Day. Now, I said that to somebody. I wrote up their Happy Boxing Day because somebody wrote up Happy Day After Christmas. So, for those of you that don't know, Boxing Day is the day after Christmas. It's actually... That guy needs to put his tailgate up, for God's sakes, mister. He's driving a pickup truck. These are small places. And that idiot has his tailgate stuck out you know and he's not hauling anything so there's no point in it you know except his tailgate probably didn't work but so i pulled up in here as tight as i could yeah oh hello the police officers are here huh wonder what's going on with that anyways you never know i'll catch you guys in a few minutes because i gotta run and get Judy something to eat, but I gotta run in here and get some milk and some pudding, a couple things we're missing that we haven't had since the stores were closed. Alright, catch you later. Well, apparently the police were called over somebody, I don't know if it was a street person or who it was, but you guys will find this funny. Apparently it was over a shopping cart and it wasn't me involved. They were telling them, apparently somebody was trying to take a shopping cart or something about the shopping cart and they told them that they couldn't do that, whatever it was. And they got mad because apparently they bought some groceries and I take it they bought quite a bit and they wanted to take a shopping cart and wheel it all home because they were walking probably. And they didn't like the employees tell them they couldn't take the shopping cart off the premises. And Steve Carpenter, you'll understand that. <laughs> and because uh, we don't have them kind of fancy safety features on our shopping carts. You know, it is shopper's value after all. But, so they got mad and they, they I don't know if they threw it, it looks like they threw, threw an egg or something splattered all over the window, hit the window and splattered all over them. And, uh, <laughs> see, I told you, shopping carts, it's in, you know, put them up. Don't abuse them. Don't steal them. You know, I thought you guys would get a kick out of that. All right, I'll talk to you after a bit. Okay, well, Charlie's was closed, so I came home and asked Judy. And so, guys, if you don't hear from me in the future, it's because of the food I ate because she still wants chicken there's only one place I know of 
actually there's two places let me pull over here and see and I'll be right back with you let's see if I can find their menu on the phone I may go there because uh, their chicken's good too otherwise I got to go to KFC and I don't want to so be back in I stopped earlier to check on the phone because I didn't want to go to Kentucky Fried Chicken to get Judy's Chicken, so I checked to see if Church's was open, and they are, and, and they're pretty good. Uh, uh, we've ate there before. It's been a long time since I've ate there, and it's been a while since I've ate at this one, but last time I was there, it was really good, so just on a little bit shadier side of town, a little bit rougher, but uh, hey, you know. Uh, uh, let's see. Turn here to get in that parking lot. I guess I could have turned there too. So, but anyways, I'm gonna go in here and get some church chicken. I ain't had any in a while, so uh, go see what they got. They got a two-piece mix. Let's see if I can get a two-piece wing and a two-piece. Uh, all right, we'll talk at you. Uh, that's, it's been a while, but not bad. Didn't spend too, didn't spend much more than I did on, than, than I do over at uh, Charlie's. Now, if the food's just as good, I'll be a happy camper. And look there, I get to get out here and not get run over. That's always a bonus. Food smells good. They have, that's where mama has been wanting me to get corn on the cob. And I knew there was a chicken place that had it, but I forgot about churches. So I always forget which one of these streets it is I turn on when I come from here. It's a little bit different side of it. It's, it's my side of town, but it's a little bit different part. And uh, okay, I think it's up here and around. Yep, yep, gotta go around the curve. This is one of those weird places where they set the town, town east and west, north and south. But it's, you're gonna see I'm making a turn, okay? Now on this turn is where they change the direction of the town. It's still going east and west, north and south. But one is going, the one part of town is going magnetic and the other part of town is going true. So, and I'm not sure which is which. I'm not sure. Uh-oh. That's not good. Uh, shit. Sorry about that. The phone rang about the time that the chicken fell over. And I was trying to get it. And I was trying to get stopped at the stop sign. The phone rang. I didn't want to talk. And I said a bad word. So I'll edit out the bad word. I'm home now and I'll have some I'll put I'll edit this all out and put up my mutterings for today on today's vlog and y'all have a good one. I'm a grumpy vlogger. I'm out of here. Bye bye for now. And don't forget to subscribe or check out what's up here. Don't forget to subscribe, to like, check out what's over here and what's over here. You be nice to everybody, okay? I'm the Grumpy Vlogger. I'm out of here. Bye-bye for now.